Water utility bills on Guam are set to rise 32 percent over the next five years. Yet according to the Guam Water Works Authority, scores of households with illegal pipe connections still aren't paying a cent for the water they use. Two years ago, GWA estimated that as many as 15 to 20 percent of water utility connections on Guam were illegal. That number has begun to decline due to GWA's efforts to crack down on water theft. However, GWA spokeswoman Heidi Ballendorf says this year alone, the utility has collected about $50,000 in fines linked to illegal connections. They know they're, they're cheating all of us. They're cheating you and I and, and the ratepayers because just like anything, uh, that costs us money. Sure. So we have to pass that on to someone. I mean, we eat all these costs, but in the end, we have to pass it on. We're, we're a business. GWA's ongoing effort to replace water meters on the island with newer computerized models linked to a radio network has uncovered a host of illegal connections, but this program has yet to reach many corners of Guam. For example, Ballendorf says the village of Derido may hold dozens of illegal water connections that have previously gone unreported. In some parts of the island, the water utility meters are 40 years old and easy to tamper with, giving would-be thieves plenty of opportunity to steal water at the expense of others. This has prompted GWA to put locks on many meters to bar thieves from manipulating them. Meanwhile, Simon Sanchez, chairman of the Consolidated Commission on Utilities, says that the meter replacement plan is roughly two-thirds of the way to completion, and GWA will penalize anyone caught stealing water. We live in an island that is best when we do things together and we share the load. If you're trying to steal from this community, then you should be stopped, and, and, and in this small way, GWA contributes to stopping it. But for now, GWA says that the full scope of the problem remains unknown, with large sections of the island still not being monitored for illegal connections. GWA warned that anyone with an illegal connection could face a $2,500 penalty in addition to having to pay backed bills and possible civil fines. Stefan Sebastian, PNC News.